Hi guys, so today's tutorial is going to be very quick and simple. It's going to be showing you how to create a button in HTML that you can click and then it loads to an external web page. So we're going to use Notepad++. If you've never used it before, it's absolutely brilliant. It's free to download, so just go check it out. First thing you want to want to do is go to language H and set it to HTML. Then you're going to want to open up your HTML tags and make sure that you close it off afterwards. Um, it's always good practice to close them off straight away. Normally in a HTML page you have a head and a body. So we'll just open up a head but we don't need it for this case. So we're just going to leave it blank. And then we're just going to go ahead and open up the body. And inside the body all we're going to simply do is we're going to use a form. So we're going to do form action equals... And um, we're going to leave that blank for a second. And then we're going to do button type. And we're going to do it as submit. And then we're going to give it a space. And then we're going to give it a backslash button to close that tag off. And then we're just simply going to go ahead and close the form. So... In this section here, you're going to simply want to put the link to whatever web page you want to redirect people to. So we'll just do a couple of examples. We'll just do um, google.com. Oops. And we will, in here, do um, whatever you want the button to display. So if you want to say click here, you put click here. If you wanted it to say Google, you click Google. Save that in your local area and then simply run it in whatever browser you wish. So as you can see, I said click here. So it's saying click here. And when you click this link, it will, or the button even, it opens up an external link, which is Google. So I'm quickly just going to show you guys another one just to prove that this does work. And so I'm just going to copy and paste it. And then in here, we're going to change it and we're going to put um twitter.com and in here we're just going to simply put twitter and we're going to go ahead and we're going to save this and we're going to launch this in chrome and if you click this button it should take you to twitter so that is it it's very simple you can then go ahead and use css to style these and put them more into your web page but that is it for the tutorial I hope you guys found it useful. Give this video a thumbs up if you did and be sure to subscribe to the channel. Leave any comments down below on any type of video you want to be seeing on this channel and I will get a tutorial up. Thank you for watching guys. Bye.